He shouldn't be walking alone. Also, it's also so bad. Privilege to have an interview with Ibrahim Owoduni, uh, who was declared wanted yesterday. Uh, we had this interview with him just before he turns himself in to the police. Uh, let's go. Ibrahim, um, police say they've declared you wanted. That no, that they've been trying to. They've called you separately and you refused to come. Um, I, I can't say that's a big lie. Like, I, you know, I would like to receive a message from the police and I will refuse them. Even now, before before all this wanted issue, I, I even want to turn myself, like not turning in, I want to go and explain myself at the station because people started accusing me wrongly and so, but people that I called said I should chill, I should not go anywhere. So the police, you know, like I should wait for them to invite me. So I keep waiting, waiting and suddenly I just found myself wanted online yesterday. People started calling me that I wanted one millionaire for who find me. And I was shocked. I was surprised. I called my lawyer, called my family, and they just asked, they just said I should just calm down, that nothing will happen. So far, I know nothing about it. So, and I'm here now, so. Okay, what's your relationship with Mubad? Uh, Mubad is my childhood friend. He's my friend. Like, Bobo, all those time that um, stepmother no care. I was, I was, I was, I was his stepmother then. I was his dad. I was his friend. I was everything to him, because he lived with me then. My mom feed two of us together. Okay. So, were you no. with him the day he died? No, I was. I was not with him. You were not with him. I was not with him. I, we departed after that show because he chased me down from the car. Um, that was um, um on Sunday. Mm. On Sunday, he called me on Sat on Friday. Mm. To come over on the island i don't even know he has a shoe so me getting to the island and he told me i uh, were just in having fun this that and next thing just said um sorry i did not tell you i have a shoe at the do the general i said i did not tell me now and that day or that on sunday the next day is my brother's birthday so and i said okay okay and i said after the sh after the um show then i can invite my brother to call me then he will he will he will like is he talking to me he said after he said after the show that let's go for the show first. That after the show, then I will invite my friend over and for them like I will invite my junior brother over and he will celebrate the birthday to him. Okay. And I said okay. So why did why did he chase you out? Why did you say he, he chased me out at town hall inside the car inside why? the because I was like him and his wife were having an hidden like conversation which maybe about this or that but I don't even know is his family at first so I can't. But one thing I don't want is don't get down from the car. Uh, but on that matter, the issue that him and his wife had were like, nobody is fucking hot because I know him. And so it was not like, I want to get down from the car. I said, why will you come down from the car? Why are you like this now? Then I'll be the one to get down to go and clear the road. This, that, Slatan is still on stage. So Mobad, calm down. How do you feel that they are saying you know something about his death? How did I feel? I don't even know how I feel losing him. So now they are not accusing me. So the feelings is crazy. Like... I just know God see it all like along um all got to show cook um all the day lot of lunch. So what do you want now? Uh, I want I want justice. I yes. want justice for Mubar and I want that his wife. Mm. Why would why would his wife go online and start framing me? That's wrong. Um, <coughs> nothing really happened. Um, Mubar, I saw Mubar miss call on Saturday, and um. When I was when I saw the missed call, I was shocked and I was like, oh, my Uber called me. Then I called him back immediately and he told me, fine, can I come over? I'm going to just chill. I'm going to miss him, you understand? And I said, okay. Immediately when I heard the news, I, I ran to I ran to my friend and I'm going to the island this that. And he said, no problem, that he would join me soon because the next day is my brother's birthday. So even everybody will be there too. So and I said, okay, but me, I'm going today because I need to be with mobile. I'm getting to the island. I got to the island in the evening around seven something. So getting there, I saw mobile in the parlor with his with some guys, with his boys, playing with his kids. Then immediately I dropped my bag and 
ticket key that a sign playing with him with greeted each other and asked me what did I want. I said, oh, I don't want any see this time, go and get me Chelsea. And he, go, he went and sent someone to go and get me a bottle of it. Chelsea. And when we were drinking, having fun, talking, he was, he was playing some old told me that um, he's having show in Ikodu. Um, that is tomorrow. And I said, ah, tomorrow, ah, should I tell me now? Tomorrow is my brother's birthday too. Then he told me that, okay, let's do it this way. He said, um, Ibrahim, we, um, we, after that show, I will invite my brother to come to his house in um, Royal Pine and he will celebrate another birthday for him. And I accepted and oh, okay, it's another celebration and my brother will be happy to be with you as well. So we get into the show, we, um, we got to a Butemeta and his wife, and as in him and his wife started having some arguments, eating arguments, which I don't even, like the way, I don't even, you know, I, I don't need to interfere in that family issue. So I was just looking, but the, the, the matter keep popping up like, I don't understand, even after the show, even after the show, and I, I, I scored my back to the car, and I said, wait, say, let me go and clear the road. I started clearing the road, and I was saying, that, calm down, you, no car can leave here now, until Zlantan and other artists, because we came in together with convoy, so only you can leave. Well, I noticed my bad was angry, and because he don't want to stay in the car with his wife, because they were having one or two, but... It was eating to me, but Mobad was not happy that I was the one telling him, Oti Tona, oh, they go, she be by Lotima, so go go, Matayle. And that was what I was just telling him, and he was angry that I did not give him the chance, like to, like, to pour his mind out at that moment. And I told him, This is not where you do this. When you get home, then solve your family problem. This is a show. This is, you are here to have fun. Just smile. And he wants to come down from the car. And I was like, Don't come down from the car. I was sitting here. His wife was sitting down at our middle, and Mobad was sitting down there, and his wife, his wife was holding uh, Liam, that was his son. So I was not like, you can see your son here, you don't need to do all this. Then he came down and turned, like maybe my own is getting too much, maybe in his family, and he asked me, he just open the door, and, because there was security with him, army, on your ball, because they were shocked that Mobad came down without going on stage. So they were they they followed him to where I was sitting and then he opened the car and now okay, look, Shelley, bye. He started eating me and saying that very prime, prime. I said okay, look, Shelley. The next thing say we have bullet. Bullet money I can bullet bow. She very disgraced me by him. She bought your wallet the island. The bully man can bullet. So I was just smiling, saying it. So I want me and one woe, I won't quia maybe I won't share any due to I was still smiling. So the next thing I saw, uh, he's taking a person, and the military, and the, they saw, uh, this one is taking a person. So they hold his hand, and they hold his hand and said, okay, prime, you come down and go. Then I came down from the car, and I, I found my way. I went straight to the stage to meet Kubana chief priest, and explained to him that, sir, I don't understand what's going on. That, um, I don't understand that Mobad is my child friend, and all of a sudden, he asked me to get out from the car, he started eating me. But I, I don't know what's going on. The Kubana chief priest asked me, okay, stay here. Let me go and make findings of what is going on. Then I left. I, I asked, he asked the security, watch over him. Don't let him leave here. Then I said I won't. Then I stood. Then immediately, me checking out. Let me go to Kubana chief priest. I'm waiting for him to come and give me feedback. I just, I, everywhere was empty. Both the Prado. We bought like 15 Prados or 10. With the general boss, everyone, we came together and everywhere like dry immediately. So I was shocked. So I only called my director, and, ah, I can't come out of this ghetto. You know all this Omota that are there, I don't want them to wound me. And he said I should hold on. He called someone that is living around that town hall and said, ah, hello, go on. That, that person seems to be someone that went to man, Lugon, go from one church, you know. Lower, so find me come me to gbe o okada so the ba se ku mi me pelo kara ti ko na o mo tan ya de book uba a de bi ma ti director mi a de gba island lo lo si apartment am bro mi tin she birthday and i explain what happened to him that this that think pe pe mi am over the link we have little toy and ask me to get out from his car this that but that does not stop me from celebrating with you so i came back for your birthday and that was all then we started having fun, this, that, then on Monday, like it happened on, and I was on the island on Monday. So on Monday, and, I, and my bag is inside a Prado with my director bag. So and I, I, told, I told my director, I need my bag, you know my passport is inside a bag. So I, and I can't risk leaving my passport there. So I would like get it. Then I text Wumi, which is my bad wife, that's Cynthia. I said, Cynthia, I need my bag, 
and my director's bag and he's traveling tonight. He need what is inside the bag. And she told me, um, don't come here for now. Can you come? She texted it and I even said, I have the proof of everything. So and she said, don't come here for now. I said, don't come here for now. But I so I just I started texting and she did not reply me. So I text um some mobile friends, um boys, that was lifestyle already. So I text Lifestyle and Lifestyle said, okay, he saw the bag that, that I should not be angry about that. But I said, no, it's my, it's my it will soon call me now and everything will be over between us. So it's just no matter. So ju I just need my bag. And that one said, okay, he has already seen the bag and the bag. And he said, he's not at home now, but you give me someone number that will go and get. So I sent my director to drive there with Uber that help me go there, go and get my bag. I'm, I'm, I was in the apartment at my brother's birthday so my director went there and they gave him the bag which which with my own bag with his own bag my director they gave him the bag my own bag and his own bag that was le that was left in because you can't go back and take the bag because of the accident that happened so and I, I asked my director when you get there what were they doing he said oh, he did not see bad, but he saw his boys playing tape tennis in the compound so they just opened the gate and passed my own bag to him and his own bag I said that was all. for me to see my bag. My bag will call me by itself. I'm happy that, that I'm playing. So the next day, that was maybe Tuesday or so. I just after the birthday, the next day, I just ah, we find um, um, my man in my own roadside manager, which is banking. He said, "Prime, I'm going to the mainland." I said, "Well, me, I'm not doing anything here." My bag, I actually, I want to come and play with everybody. Through me, people see my bag too. So. And now is we are having courage, so let's just go back to the mainland, chew our brain, then we can come late, maybe later. So we get to Ikorodu uh, in the morning, uh, in the morning because we left Ikorodu very early, and we get to Ikorodu in we, we we get to Ikorodu in the morning, and we get into Ikorodu, we find a place to go and rest because the stress was too much, so we have to go and rest in a friend's place. So I was sleeping, my friends were sleeping, my outside mind, everybody we slept off, and the next thing was prime, 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 ah. I'm on the mobile to cool. I say I'm a cotton shesh. I'm about to cool bow. I say why me? And my phone phone was switched off. Unless I'll be the first person to hear the news. But my own phone was switched off. So immediately I was shaking and I just go and plug my phone. I just start seeing messages popping up. People were saying, "Prime, is it true? This is it true? This?" Ah, I was shocked. I was not like I made. I immediately I went online and said, "Are you satisfied now?" Because. They are always, he's always complaining about people chasing him, this, that, and I'm only seeing no videos online, this, that. And I was not happy what I saw, so I said, okay, the next thing, like, in the next three hours, I just asked him my videos. He said he fought with one of his friends at Ikorodu, and that one beat him with a ring in his hand. And I was like, hey, they even told, they said police was, the was, police invited me. No one invited me. I'm not a criminal. I've never even, for my life, I, I don't even know any police case. He like, me. Nobody invited me. I was even calling some management that said, what should I do? I called like Obagi because military were there, Onyabo was there, um, police was there. So I would like to touch him because they don't know me, they know you, they would disgrace me instantly. So I was just like smiling. So I was pretending that nothing happened to even them, but mobile was August for Ujugo Gwen. Yes, I, 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 I called. I called the commissioner this morning, and um, I've told him we're coming in at 12 o'clock. As you can see, we're here before 12. So I'm taking Owoduni Ibrahim, aka him Pry Boy, to the commissioner of police now, in charge of Pansy, so that he can state his own side uh, of the entire incident. So, and I have trust.